Hey everybody, Daniel from Tech65 here. Right now I'm going to be doing uh, a final test, uh, when you're, uh, quantitative test on the Sony Vio P, Sony's uh, latest ultra portable. And uh, this test is going to be calculating the amount of time it takes for the cam, uh, the the Vio P, to boot up and uh, to make it more realistic for real life example, going to take how long it takes for it to boot up all the way to the moment you open uh, Google Chrome. All right, so. Here's my stopwatch, and here we go. Okay. Take away the card. By the way, I am currently using the Samsung ST50 um, video mode. Um, this camera can actually record up to uh, 800 uh, by, I can't remember what's the resolution for video, and right now I'm filming this at 640 by 480, and I'm going to put this up to YouTube natively. Okay, so I see the mouse now, it's at uh, 40 seconds. See the Windows logo. Okay, so while it's doing that, I'm just going to... Um, the rest of Windows is still loading as you can see the mouse is still a little spinning circle okay it's a minute already so you know the amount of time it takes to get to the screen is about one minute okay so now I'm gonna try to open Google Chrome Windows is still loading as you can see the start button is a bit unresponsive is opening and Google Chrome a minute and 40 seconds so that's how long it took and uh, the computer is still loading actually so uh, oops I think my mouse just froze so re realistically it's going to take you about two minutes before you can actually get the VIOP up and running right so that was a test um, for boot up time and the amount of time it takes for it so it's still loading the sidebar just open and all that. Okay, I think it's about it's done. It's just finished loading. I already stopped the stopwatch. So it's about two minutes, okay, for Windows to completely load and for you to use it uh, completely. All right. Uh, I'm Daniel from Tech65. Uh, be sure to catch out the review, the written review on Tech65.org. Bye.